Hey everybody, my name is Ace Fangirl, and welcome back to another episode of Dang and Rampa 2. Goodbye, despair. Things are getting freaking wild. So last time, Nagito went a little bit crazy and kind of confessed to murder, but uh, he never actually said that he murdered Byakuya, and turns out he didn't. He just literally set up everything to murder Byakuya, and then didn't get to go through with it because Byakuya kind of cut him off. Um, so good for Byakuya. Hooray! On the other hand, Nagito's crazy. That's cool. Um, so he's still being a little bit wacky, uh, but we are talking about how it was not possible for the knife that Nagito prepared to be the murder weapon because the murder weapon was too small. So we need to figure out what's going on. We need to find Byakuya's killer by any means possible. Also that. Because <laughs> if we don't, we we will die here. Yeah, we're not gonna let that happen. Oh, don't worry about it. We got it. Don't worry about it. Don't be so panicked. It's all right. We got time. Oh my god. What? What? Wait, what is this? What's happening? Wait. Oh god. Well now. Now then the class trial has reached its climax, but okay, here's a question for you. What's this? So those of you who figured out who it is, how about you try out the guess the killer challenge? Whoever fails to guess the right killer will have their save data melt away like butter. Are you serious right now? But if you guess right, I'll reward you with ten billion dollars. Oh, you're not serious right now. You playing me. Ten billion? Of course, for those of you who don't know who the killer is, you can just continue on. What are you gonna What are you gonna do? Can I make like multiple saves? Wait. Oh, I'm so tempted to do it. I don't know what will happen if I if I guess wrong. What will happen though? Can I like make another save? <laughs> will that work? Oh man, if I screw this up, I think it'd be hilarious. Okay. No man, I'm totally hang on. I'm gonna make like just in case I made two saves. <laughs> okay. No, no, no. I want to try it. I... I... Played me? You played me! Just kidding, you can't make a choice! There's no way you'd be able to guess who the killer is. <laughs> and of course, there's no ten billion dollars either! You suck. You are so villain! Evil. You truly are a villain! That was rude. Wait, seriously, are we stopping now? Oh my god. Well, I'm just probably just gonna tack this on to the end of the last one then. Oh. Oh god, we're starting again. Wait, what's happening? I'm so confused. I'm, Mona me, and my heart is like crazy I'm sorry right to hear now. that. The group leader Byakuya got killed. And his killer is among this group of students? No, I'm not gonna believe it. I'll I'm so confused about what's going on. Yeah, okay, man. listen, I don't, so. So do your best, and don't forget to save the Okay, family. thanks. What was that? Well, what was what that? Now? What just happened? If the knife isn't the murderer, I don't understand. There's no definitive proof that I'm the killer. Shut up! We'll be the Yeah, I don't think he did it. You say you were shoved away, but you can't actually prove it, right? That's right. Even if a different weapon was I mean, used, okay, yes, that's it fair. does not mean Nagito has been cleared of suspicion. But, but there's another reason why I don't think Nagito is the killer. Why is that, darling? There's still more? Based on what we've discussed, Yakuya was killed under the table, yes. right? Is there something wrong with that? Well, even if that's true, I feel Nagito looks, you know, clean. Nobody's ever complimented me on my <laughs> appearance before. Not even my I own I think mother. I complimented you on your appearance earlier in this LP. But whatever. I guess I don't matter. I'm not talking about your look. So this is where the tablecloth's gonna come in. Why does Mikan think Nagito looks so clean? Because there's no freaking blood on him. I see. And there wasn't. Are you trying to say something like, why didn't Nagito have any? Don't worry, girl, I got you. Yes, th that's it. Because 
under the table, there was yeah. a lot of blood splattered Yeah, but not, remember, right. Nagato really didn't want me to find that tablecloth. There were even blood stains on the inside of the tablecloth. How the hell would he have gotten he that? He stabbed Byakuya to death. It's strange he did not get splattered with an appropriate amount of blood. I didn't get any blood on me. That is weird. I don't know what your deal is right now, but you need to tr you need you to cool it. You just used something to block the blood, didn't you? Something that might have been used to block the blood splatter. Well, what do you think it could have been? Hmm. I guess we did see something. Yes. That used. And it was the thing that made me Isn't suspect that right, you. Hajime? Cause you wanted to get me away from it real freaking quick. Bloodstained tablecloth we found in the storage room, right? If there are bloodstains on it, that settles it. Nagito the weapon used still the doesn't fit, to block so... the blood splatter. But that was found in the storage room, right? Yeah, how also are how would he have gotten it there? I was thinking that there too. After the murder? You mean after the lights came back on? What would he have done if we'd seen him? That's true. The tablecloth was pretty big. So even if you tried to hide it and take it with you. Wearing a tablecloth, going under the table, hitting a knife in a blackout, and stabbing it's pretty. Someone. That's not just impossible for someone like me. Wouldn't it also be impossible for you guys, too? Th then, what does it mean? What do you think, girl? You're my new favorite. Maybe. The killer didn't necessarily stab Yakuya under the table. Huh? No. There's no mistake that the murder occurred under that table. Even the inside of the tablecloth is bloody. So there's no denying Yakuya was. Every time they show me the shot, I just get sad. But that doesn't mean where Yakuya got stabbed and where the killer did the stabbing are the same, right? Are you gonna? Are, are you trying to say under the floor? Because that's also what I was thinking. I don't understand at all. But you could be saying it in a less confusing manner. The place where Byaku got stabbed and where the killer did the stabbing are different. Huh? You look like you're on the How wouldn't you like that? Really? Well, that sounds like a riddle. I feel like I'm kind of onto something, but it's still not clear what that is. Under the table, but not under the table. If it's somehow possible, it's Yeah, we're definitely going under the floor here. Moving forward, we should put aside all unnecessary preconceptions and just choose the answer. Yeah, you're officially the best. It seems we have to figure out important words. The improved hangman's gambit will occur. Oh boy! The goal is to line up the right letters in order so it reveals a key word related to the instant question. Improved Hangman's Gambit is like a little puzzle game. Various letters will be flying across the screen in all directions. There are two rules you must remember. If two different letters clash, you'll take damage. If two of the same letters clash, they will fuse. You must make two of the same letters clash while you try not to let two different letters clash. This does not sound improved. That's what's most important. In order to do that, you've been given a technique to catch and release. When you move the reticle with the mouse and press the right mouse button while it's on top of the letter, you can snatch the letter like a vacuum. That's what it means to catch the letter. However, you can only catch one letter at a time, so please be careful. When you press the right mouse button, when you have a letter caught, you can shoot it where your cursor is aiming. This is how you release the letter. With catch and release, you can change the position of letters and hit letters into each other. Make sure you hit the same letters so you can fuse them. The fused letters will freeze and get bigger. By pressing the right mouse button, you can blow it up and erase it from the field. This is called firing the letters. Catch and release with the right mouse button, and after you fuse them, fire with the right mouse button. There's a whole lot of right mouse buttons. However, if you just erase letters, you won't be able to clear the game. Ultimately, the main goal of improved Hangman's Gambit is completing the keyword. Display the question with the tab key and figure out with what keyword will answer that question. About lining up the keyword, instead of pressing the right mouse button to fire the letter, please press the left mouse button. If that happens at the same time that the letter blows up, it'll be sent to the keyword list. If the sent letter is correct, it will fit in the keyword list. If not, the influence gauge will take damage. You must write the keyword in order. Based on the flying letters, please think about the complete word. Also, if you leave a fuse letter alone for a while, it'll just blow up on its own. In that case, it'll still damage you, so please be very careful. This sounds like it sucks. 
I took too long, so long to explain it, but do you understand now? Honestly, no. I, I don't. Uh, well then, good luck and have fun. Oh my god, we're gonna die. What is happening? Please do not show me this picture the whole time. Using those words as a clue, I should put aside my preconceptions and try to think about it. Something, something's coming to me. Just a little bit more, I have a feeling I can see something. Okay. What do we got? Under the floor. Okay. Um... Wait. Okay, there we go. Alright, I understand. Um... Okay. Um, I can't tell if those are gonna collide or not. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, I see. Oh, God. Oh, God. What? This is so- how do I- I- Okay, that's fine. How do I get rid of something? Oh, okay, I see. All right, I understand how this is working now, but I don't want that. Oh god. Okay, it's still working. Okay. <laughs> My computer that I'm recording the audio on just turned off. I was very confused. Okay, I need another E, please. Are those gonna collide? I can't tell. No, okay. Oh god. Okay, I think this one's gonna collide. But I can't- I have something- I don't want this! How do I get it to go away? So I gotta start, like, making... Okay, I think I see. So I can start, like... Making big ones. But now I'm gonna have to start catching them really quick! Or that's gonna happen. Oh wait, I didn't shoot the E. I didn't want that. Oh my god, this is difficult. I do not like this at all. This- how am I supposed to get- I'm, I feel that I am missing something here. Under, okay. Oh god. Oh god. Oh damn. No, no, no. Oh shit. Oh. This sucks. I hate this, actually. Is this terrible or am I just really bad? Am I just really stupid? I honestly can't tell. Okay, um, okay, that's fine. Um, no, 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 do not blow up my huge E. I, I need that. No, 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 no. Oh, you bitch. Oh, God, okay. Oh, uh, this is the, this is actually certifiably the worst. No, 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 I wanted that. Aw, oh, Jesus. Okay, do that, do that. Okay, good. I hate this with every fiber of my being. This is not fun. I don't want this, though. Okay. Oh, God, grab that. Oh, God. Grab that, grab that. We want that. And now we need more O's. We need more O's, please. Give me more O's. Let's get the R. What? Ah, oh, Jesus. Got it. Done. That sucked. I hated that. That was terrible. That took so long. That was, t that was torture. And I died a lot. I'm gonna suck at that. Is there a better way? Am I missing something there? You can tell me. Under the floorboards? Yeah. That's the I think. floorboards in the old building are full of gaps, and there was no carpet laid out under the table. If they stuck the weapon through Man, one. Man, I was doing so well in this trial, that's gonna tank my score. Sorry. I'm not thinking about that. If so, that means the killer was able to get under the That's the part I haven't figured out. I don't know that yet, but I have a feeling there's someone here who does know. 
right, if I remember correctly, one person here should know how to get under the floorboards. Gundam. Because he got his earring back. Excuse me. There we go. Where are you, Gundam? Where are you? There you are. You. You should know. Look at how much my influence gauge suffered! In the dining hall, right? referring to the hell hound. I am? About that ear. How the hell did you get it back? I said, are you oh my god, referring yes. to the hellhound earring? About that hellhound earring. You dropped it beneath the floorboard, right? Yes. I remember. <laughs> Just a bit longer, and I would have reduced everything. Great, glad to hear it. Old building to ashes. However, it's just as the old legend said: the Hellhound earring has returned to its yeah, owner. Yeah, but how? To me. Is it safe to say that that earring is the one hanging from your right ear? Huh? Could it be? Gundam wasn't wearing an earring during the investigation. Mm -hmm. But now he is. He yes. By the time the class trial began. He must have gotten under the floorboards. Then that means Gundam was able to retrieve his earring from beneath the floorboards during the investigation. So Gundam knows how to get under the floorboards. Yes. So tell us, please. <laughs> it's understandable. After all, you fools only Someone use slap the him, please. eyes of glass. But I am different. With the power of my four dark devas of destruction, it is of no concern. True, this is the evil fourth eye. I'm gonna need you to just level with me, dude. Before the might of the evil fourth eye, all visual chaos is rendered asunder. Uh, as much as I'm interested in what you're saying, really gonna need you to just not. What should I do? I'm embarrassed just listening to him. Oh, man up and speak more clearly. Fine, I shall tell you all. The answer was in the storage room. Nagato, you know what? I knew I should have looked it back there. Nagito, you son of a bitch. One of my four dark Nagito, this is all your fault! Mirage Golden Hawk, Jumpy, has seen beyond the chaos. A secret passage of doom leading to the underground lurks beneath a large assortment of random boxes. After securing a, a writer back there. from the supermarket, I threw caution to the wind and ventured below the floor. Yeah, cool. Did you find anything else down there? And as a result of that lonesome battle, I was able to recover the hellhound earring with my own two hands. <laughs> Tremble with fear, fools! Behold my power! There he goes, blabbing about power and crap. You're ridiculous. You're just a breeder, you know. Anyway, it sounds like you can go under the floorboards from the storage room. Then that has to be how the killer did it. If the space beneath the floor is empty, it's not that far to move from the storage room to the dining hall. Yes. But who I could see. it have been? If they pass through the storage room, I understand why the tablecloth was put there. The killer lurked under the floorboards during the party, and from there... Stab! 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 So that leaves basically two people. Hmm. Are you sure? You! And you Pekko. You like Stab! Stab! Stab? Should it sound more fleshy? Like... Uh-huh. I'm not talking about your sound effects. You're saying they snuck under the floorboards, but that means they would have had to leave the party, right? So, was there anyone who was able to do well, that? Well, you! Then whoever wasn't at the party is the killer! They must be the one who was waiting under but the floorboards! But they would have had to get in! Who wasn't at the party again? I didn't participate, but I was guarding the entrance, remember? Monami over there can be my witness, right? Yes! This Monami over here is your witness! I believe there's no need to discuss this matter further, but I was unable to leave the Terror Terror! My new number one suspect! How are you? I was in the kitchen for a long time, but I frequently went to the dining hall to deliver my Yeah, but you didn't during the... Um, I only 
only person who It can't be. He couldn't have gotten in. Judging from the photo. Oh, we did take the picture. Maybe it wasn't him. He wasn't in the picture. It obviously has to be him. But he couldn't have got gotten in. It's the party. How could he have gotten in? No, 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 no. Everyone calm down. What the fuck are you saying? I'm not the killer. Oh, really? What happened to the tough guy who was saying stuff like, I can do this. Don't mess with me. I'll fucking kill Dude, you. Dude, maybe you don't want to say that right now. See? You're making pets again. Yep, yep. That's right. Things are starting to get exciting. Good news. You're now allowed to use the silencer. You can use the silencer with the right mouse button. Okay, great. When you use the silencer, you can shoot down the white noise. Also, when you shoot down the white noise, your time limit will increase a little. However, if you shoot an actual remark with your silencer instead of the white noise, the time limit will decrease. Swim carefully when you're using the silencer. Oh, but if the difficulty blah blah blah, in that case, you'll still be able to use the silencer, but it'll be somewhat pointless. However, if you feel like doing a little bang bang, you can use it to your heart's content. Bang 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 bang. Press the escape key, you can view the controls. Well then, good luck and have fun! This voice is much more interesting than the tutorial voice in Dragon Rampa 1. Okay. Um. I assume we're probably gonna be looking for Chiaki's account to say that he did come to the party, that, but was outside. During the party, the killer Here, was lurking under the floor like a cockroach. Hang on. And you could have stared at panties all day. Okay, well. Without going to the store, it drew him in the dark. Is that true, Fuyuhiko? Don't act like I'm the fucking killer! But when the party started... Nobody saw you, you know? Yeah, because he wasn't there. That means you have no alibi! There we go. That's it. No, that's wrong. Someone did see him during the party. I forget what time, but... No, Fuyuhiko definitely has an alibi. Isn't that right, Chiaki? Um... Oh, you're right. Yep, yep, you saw him. What happened? What are you doing here? All alone in a place like this? See any guards? Monokuma doesn't come inside. I saw Fuyuhiko after the party started. There's no way he could have been waiting under the floor before mm -hmm. then. You should have said that earlier, dumbass. It's still your fault. Like, why were you even lurking yeah, but he around the old in, building? So it doesn't in the first matter. Place? He wanted Shut to come up. to the party. Maybe there really is a secret passage to go under the floorboards from outside. And he came to spy. What'd you say, motherfucker? Oh no! <laughs> wow, he got chewed out, but he looks super happy. He's into it. Regardless, it's impossible to go under the floorboards from outside. Chiaki and I there has to be someone inside. Then someone definitely went under the floorboards through the storage room during the party. During the party, it was probably during the blackout. How would they have been able to see though? Well, if someone disappeared during the blackout, no one would have noticed. But walking down that dark hallway to the storage room is like trying to make eggs benedict without any eggs. You're right. I couldn't even see the office in that darkness. And that room was much closer. It's the part I haven't figured out yet. But is it really impossible? It might be better if we examine that possibility a little bit okay. more. Okay. It was super dark, you know? There's no way you'd be able to find your way to the storage room. But I can't stop thinking about it. I feel like there's something I overlooked. For clarity's sake, once again. It appears we're getting close. All right, to don't act like you know everything. The blackened or the spotless, which is superior? I think it's time to settle this. Okay. Okay. I'm thinking the fire door. The fire door has to play into it somehow. The hallway was really dark during the blackout. Moving to the storage room like that. Is that making a seafood bowl without fish? That actually sounds pretty tasty. Who said that? Really not possible. What if they used a string like the cord? Uh, maybe there was another pair of night vision no. goggles. 
feel the pain. I'm gonna go with my gut. What if they used a light? Oh! Oh! Wait! I know what it is! I'm gonna prove it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes! Really the There's a portable stove Moving in the, the kitchen. Like it's like making a seafood bowl without fish. Oh. Uh, is it really not possible? Okay, now it's. Hang on, I'm gonna use the string like the core. Blah, 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 blah. Keep going. Maybe there was another pair of oh, fish and goggles? What a pain. I'm gonna go with my gut. What if they used a light? Shit, I missed! Damn you! There we go. <laughs> I agree with Got you. it. Consent. How dare that white noise show up just then? I know. The killer had a light with him. Oh, I was right. Yes, kind of. But where could they have found a light? There was one nearby for sure. See, it's written on the kitchen's equipment list. Twenty forks, twenty knives, twenty spoons, twenty iron five iron skewers, not twenty iron skewers. Three pine plant. <laughs> 20 wine glasses. There are also iron plates for barbecue and even a portable stove for cooking hot pots. Iron plates and a portable stove. I do recall seeing them on that shelf over there. This kitchen seems to be well kept. There should be no problems using it. It's the portable stove. Portable stove? The portable stove isn't powered by electricity, and it's also small enough to carry around. Mm -hmm. So. The killer used the portable stove to move from the hallway to the storage room during the blackout. I see. I never considered the portable stove. But there's a hole in your argument. What's that, babe? Huh? A hole. What kind of hole? Don't. It would be great if you could explain it to me in Just much more detail. Don't. Oh, I wasn't making a perverted joke or anything. It's really not a perverted joke. I'm not serious. Hmm. Repeating yourself just makes it even more suspicious. Now then, Hajime, will you battle against me? It would be my pleasure. No, that's wrong. Bring it on, bitch. Will you be able to break through my argument? I believe it. What does he mean, battle? It sounds like he's enjoying a game or something. Damn it, there's no way I'm gonna lose against someone like him. Yes, let's let's dance. Let's dance, Nagito. I don't know what it is yet. Uh, Did you forget what Kazuichi said earlier? He said the hall was too dark to see the office. The light from the stove that you mentioned. It contradicts his testimony. Or are you intentionally doubting his testimony? No, no, no. Oh, get that one. I can't back down. Ah! Oh, come on. That's so hard. It's a little bit more and I can draw something out. Okay. Did you I don't know how to do the diagonal said ones. He said the hall was too dark to see the office. The light from the stove that you mentioned. It contradicts his testimony. Okay. Oops, oops. Or are you intentionally doubting Oh, okay. I see. Oh, that's hard. That's hard. I think the portable stove is used as a light source contradicts Kazuichi's testimony. I don't think what Kazuichi said is wrong. I guess for now I should offer a rebuttal. Did you forget what Kazuichi said earlier? He said the hall was too dark to see the office. The fire door. The fire the door. The stove that you mentioned. It contradicts his testimony. Or are you intentionally doubting his testimony? Oh, wow, this is hard. I can't hit them. I can't back down. Oh, I got you! I got you! Oh! I don't doubt what Kazuichi said. What are you trying to say? Yeah, stupid. <laughs> That's the reason Kazuichi couldn't see the office. Oh shit! Was because the hallway was dark, right? So if a light was shining in such a dark hallway. Nope. Sorry. Such meager hope. There's no way I could let you win. Shut up, bitch. The reason Kazuichi couldn't see the office was because the hallway was dark, right? So if a light was shining in such a dark hallway, wouldn't Kazuichi have There we seen go. It? That's it. Allow me to cut through those words. Oh, okay. I kind of like those. Those are fun. Nagito, did you forget? Or are you just pretending you forgot? <laughs> Bitch. Huh? What are you talking about? There should have been a wall that blocked light. 
The fire door. I'm talking about the fire door in the hallway. If you close it, it would form a perfect wall in the hallway. Plus, the hallway rounds a corner just beyond the fire door. So even if there was a small gap in the door, as long as they passed the corner, the light still wouldn't peek out. Mm -hmm. I see. I actually noticed the fire door. We were together. This is expected of the ultimate. Wow. Oh, nope. You still don't remember your talent. Just do you? No. Yeah, who cares about that right now? Nagato, what are you plotting? For someone who insists he's not the killer, you are quite nosy. You sound so scary. If you're that angry, why don't you take a deep breath? That sounded creepy. You sure like to piss us off. How about I shut your fucking mouth for you? Hey! It's okay if you guys fight, but I won't allow a burly brawl that might offend people. Okay. More importantly, can you hurry up and decide who's the blackened already? Time runs out when I get bored. We're getting there. Fine, I get it. You're telling me to pass the torch, right? Pass the torch? We're going to ask the real killer, not an imposter like me, to show themselves. <laughs> You're obviously no. the killer, right? For the last time. If you think I am, I really don't mind. Whatever conclusion you ultimates arrive at, I don't know what your deal is, dude. No matter what it is. So you're telling me to call out the real killer. Even though I really don't want to condemn that person. Huh, <laughs> well, but there's no other way, right? The person who used the hallway's fire door's cover and used the portable stove to move in the dark and snuck under the floorboards to stab Biaki to death using the glowing paint as a mark. The only killer I could think of is... Wait. You and only you. How would they have known about the paint, though? I'm gonna- I'm about to look real stupid if I'm wrong. But... I think it has to be him, right? It's the only way this makes sense. You're right? Could it be you? What? What? What are you talking about? Terry, Terry, is the yeah. Girl? Is that true? I don't understand that glowing paint remark because I don't think that works. But whatever. What are you talking about? There's no way. Of course, that's simply my assumption. So if you have an objection, please be free. Uh, objection or not, why am I being treated like the killer? Because. The portable stove used in the murder came from the kitchen. That's it? That's the only reason you're treating me like a killer? Isn't that a little drastic? You're cruel. Cruel. Too cruel. Ah, uh, oh, Terry. That attitude is so not like you. Or the ultimate cook gets so upset. Call me chef. If you fall to aspersions like this, who will be there to support the future of the culinary arts? Can you stop arts? being an instigator, please? The, the future of the culinary arts? That's right. For the future of the culinary arts, you must face this and fight it fair and square. You're right. Yeah, that's totally right. I think we're getting down to it. So what's an aspersion anyway? Is it oh, yummy? Let's just... Did you know asbestos is yummy Oh my too? god. You should try some. I lied, I do like her. Nagito, why are you Yeah, stop! Shut up! Let's assume that the killer used a light. And that they used the fire door to mask that light. And that they moved to the storage room and snuck under the floorboards. Yeah, this is where it kind of falls apart. It's dark under the floorboards too. So how would they be able to stab Miyaku? You're not gonna say they shined the light on the Akuya, right? The plan would have been ruined if he noticed. That's right. What do you think about that? This is the part I haven't figured out yet. That's... There's no way you can answer, right? You personally haven't investigated what's beneath the floor. No, boards. I haven't. If that's the case, then Gundam should know. He actually went under the floor. Is there anything there? No. 
Unfortunately, there was nothing related to the incident under the Great, of course there wasn't. The only thing I found was a strange liquid shining in the darkness, near where Byakuya's blood was dripping. What? A shining liquid in the dark? That sounds super- Yeah, it does. What is it? If there was a shining mark like that, they would have been able to move to it in the dark, right? And in doing so, it might have been possible for them to use- But that the would have required the victim. them to know about the knife. The victim was targeted by a mark. What was the mark? Uh... Shit! No, I didn't mean to do that! I- I was trying to read it! I was trying to read it! Oh, son of- I pushed the wrong button! What was the mark? I was trying to read this. Thank you. Okay. I just want to make sure there's nothing that was from that. It can't be... The... the paint again, right? Okay, no, 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 no. Okay, maybe trying the knife. It can't be the paint, right? What was the mark? Is it... I'm trying to... Okay. I was trying to say that before. I was trying to point to the tape, but... The mark you're talking about is the glowing paint that was applied to the knife. Okay, right? well, I was trying to go for the tape, but whatever. Okay, we're gonna stop this one because it's running a little bit long. I'm gonna start another one. Oh, God, we're really getting down into it. I think this is it. I, th I think we're on the right track now. I'm ready to kick some ass. Let's do it in the next one. I'll see you then. Bye!